My name's Kevin Pickup. I'm the assistant pastor here at Gateway to New Life Church. I'm Teresa. I'm Kevin's wife and I am the community development coordinator and pastor's wife. We've been very much involved in church, um, very much looking at every area of church life, including the operational side, the serving side, outreach, whatever we could kind of get our, our hands into, mm. we, we kind of got involved in. And there was nowhere during the week for people to come and talk. And, and so it was always a bit of a vision to kind of find somewhere which we could call home. It's not necessarily a church building as such, but it's a place where people can come and they can talk and they can feel loved, they can be encouraged. Mm. And then they can leave kind of not necessarily as they've come. We wanted to create somewhere which was, was awesome, somewhere where people go, wow, this is church. You know, this is what it's about. And we looked at names and we looked at ideas. And then we came, someone came up with the idea, just call it the Gateway Centre. Keep it simple, you know, mm. Launceston is the gateway to Cornwall. Um, it's referred to as the gateway. Mm. It's got the gateway in the town here, an, an ancient gateway. We felt that we didn't want to build something here which was going to just be a, a kind of a place where people, church was here, and if you wanted church, you came to the building. It was about equipping people and sending them out into the community because mm. we're right bang in the middle of the community here. So I'm a volunteer police chaplain in Launceston, so I serve Launceston Police Station. Um, my role is for the police officers and police staff themselves, so not for the general public. So um, I go up there and I drink a lot of tea and coffee and chat to them, and it's kind of pastoral care. And then next to the police station is St Catherine's Primary School, and I'm a dinner lady there. So I work an hour a day, and my thinking of doing that was to be outside in the community, be in the very heart of it, um, I get on well with the teachers and staff and the children are just adorable. I also work for Launceston Money Advice Centre which is upstairs in the food bank and that was set up by Churches Together and that is a free Christian charity of helping people who are in debt or have issues with their benefits for whatever financial reason. Uh, we give free advice, um, we can help them with bankruptcy, whatever it is that their need is. Just, just help them out of debt where possible. I think, I think the one thing that we're, we're very much strong on is about bridging the gap between community and church. And, and we, if we're, we're, we're stuck in an office, we can't achieve that. Um, and, you know, we're very much firm believers in church planting. It's exciting times, really. You know, even as a movement, um, are very much moving forward. And in Cornwall alone, you, you look at how many Eagling churches there were five years ago, we're talking four, maybe five, and now you're up to 14 or 15. So over the time we've kind of got so involved with the community aspect of mm. life here in Launceston, you know, looking for opportunities, looking for needs and saying, okay, how can we help fill those gaps? Uh, how can we outwork our salvation with Jesus mm. through the community and, and be a light into the community? And as in Matthew 18, Jesus says, where two or three are gathered, he doesn't say just one person gathered and you can do church by yourself and it's great. He said where two or three are gathered, mm -hmm. I am in the midst. Mm -hmm. 